there wasn't any real warning. It came too quickly. And in November, who thinks a tornado is gonna come? When a powerful tornado tore through their town, Lisa and Jesse Hunter's home was destroyed. There's apartment complexes in front of where we are. And all I can see, we're two story, about six foot of basement wall sticking out of the ground afterwards. And there's devastation. It was unreal. Their home was gone. They had few possessions left intact and no renter's insurance. Lisa, a registered nurse, had even lost all her work clothes. The hunters had no idea how they would start over. That's when volunteers from Operation Blessing offered to help. Next thing I know, there's 16 people from Operation Blessings helping go through things that I was ready to just close the book and walk away because it was mentally draining. I was done and Operation Blessings found tons of stuff and put it in totes for us. It was just amazing because, I mean, you don't know what happens until it hits you and just random strangers walking up to you, offering help. Little did the hunters know, Operation Blessing had just begun to help. While they were preparing to move into their new apartment with no furniture or belongings, we completely furnished and decorated their new home. Oh my gosh. I can't even tell you, it's just unbelievable. You walk in and it's like decorations that I would have picked out. It's furniture I would have picked out. It's amazing to think 13 days ago to now is just, I'm now I'm shocked because of this and how to process this. I mean, it's just, it's wonderful. And thank you would never be enough words to say to you guys and everybody that's helped and it's homey now. We also gave Lisa new scrubs, shoes, and gift cards so she can buy whatever else she needs to go back to work. Before we left, we prayed with Jesse and Lisa and encouraged them as they set out to rebuild their lives. Really thankful and grateful for what Operation Blessing has done for us. It's unbelievable.